As a single guy, have you ever considered dating an older Filipino woman? Today, we will cover the good and the bad. So the first question you may be wondering is why? What is the point of dating an older Filipino woman? Well, to be honest, dating an older or younger Filipina is not wildly different, but there are many benefits to dating an older Filipina. It tends to be with younger Filipinas that they are wondering if they should move to America or Australia or Canada or start a business, have a family, buy a house and so on. Whereas older Filipinas tend to be more sure of what they actually want. There is a massive, and I mean gigantic amount of single older women in the Philippines who are beautiful and very decent. There is also a lot of single Filipinas that are mums. So if you are not interested in dating an older woman, single mums also make up a very big group of the singletons in the Philippines. However, many single Filipinas fall into the mature and mum category simultaneously. So this leads us on to the question of where can you meet a hot single Filipina? So if you are a regular viewer, you will know how against dating apps I am because I know that you will do so much better in real life, but I cannot deny how popular dating apps have become with mature Filipinas. Tinder is the best app if you are looking to meet younger Filipinos, but to meet an older woman, filipinacupid.com is a great site to use. There is also a website that tells you the most downloaded apps in the Philippines and the most visited websites, which can be really useful to find those big dating platforms. So I've added a link in the description below for your reference. A retiree friend of mine who is from Australia actually lives in Cebu City and I remember him telling me that he wanted to meet an older woman, someone who has her life sorted, someone who has her own business or her own money and basically doesn't rely on him. And he told me that he stopped going to the bars and instead went to the more fancier places around town. As you can imagine, the prices were much higher, but to be fair to him, he did find the woman that he was looking for. I know that some expats prefer to be the guy who has the money and is the provider, which is totally cool. If this is the case, you will have no problem finding someone who needs your support, especially in the Philippines. But if you are looking for a real classy woman, you need to go where the real classy women are. So what about the physical side of the relationship? Older Filipinas tend to be more comfortable with their bodies and the sexual side of their life. I often get emails from subscribers asking loads of different things, but one of the most popular topics is about dating in the Philippines. I did get an email once asking me if Filipinas are innocent in the bedroom. This is because this guy read about religion, traditional values, and I think there's some YouTube video somewhere talking about this topic. So as we know, it depends on the person, but I've never come across an older Filipina who is innocent in this respect. I won't say much more because I have to remember that this is YouTube, but I will say that there are many reasons that expats by the thousands are moving to the Philippines, and it's not only for the good weather or the beautiful beaches. Nevertheless, dating a single mum in the Philippines or an older woman in the Philippines comes with challenges. Before I recorded this video, I took a walk around the local park to ask myself, what would be your biggest fears and what challenges would you run into? I concluded a few areas such as commitment, unsure if it's a good idea and dating a Filipina who has children. So let's look at this family topic first. What I've seen over the years is that one common reason that Filipinos and uh, foreigners split up is due to the family and kids. If a Filipino wants kids, but a foreigner does not, this will cause growing problems. And I've seen this many, many, many times. So what about if you don't want kids, but you want to date a Filipina? You could find a Filipino who obviously doesn't want kids, not everybody wants kids, or you could date an older Filipina woman who has kids already. And one of the benefits of dating an older Filipina is that if she does have kids, it's likely that her kids will have already grown up, 
Whereas if you're dating a younger mum, it's likely that she will have a baby to attend to. But nevertheless, is it a good idea to date a more mature Filipina? If you are a retiree, I would say it's probably not a good idea just to completely dismiss dating an older Filipina. But I would say to be slightly careful here. It's important to consider her motives. It's also important to be careful of dating an older woman too, but there seems to be less risk when dating someone in our own age age range. Before publishing any videos about dating in the Philippines, I tend to talk with a small group of Filipina friends to make sure that I'm not talking crap. I'm currently in Cambodia doing some research for the channel and I've met some amazing Filipinas here who have gave me some great pieces of information. The first thing they said is something that we already know and that is that this changes from person to person. They mentioned that mood swings are still common with older Filipinas but on the good side, older Filipinas are are very loyal. They went on to say that it may be that some of the Filipinas have suffered a heartbreak in the past so they are looking to date foreigners for a serious relationship. 